Hello to all my friends out there. So I want to make a cheap hot roast beef sandwich. So I stockpile these beef gravies. I'm trying to make meals out of my stockpile to demonstrate, okay, so if, you know, you wanted to save your money, you could eat out of your stockpile for quite a while. You really could. And so one of the things that I stockpiled was, I will show you in a minute, This is good enough for tonight, so I'll use about, it's still a little bit frozen. One good thing about this stuff is from, from being totally frozen, within a few minutes you can, you know, defrost it, like for tonight. So I'll just put that in there and heat it up. You could, you could make a white sauce gravy, but that would be labor intensive. This is not. So I just want to heat my uh, beef up. Okay, so now, let's see if this, I wanted to demonstrate my, uh, see my spices are still messed up. Okay, so now, uh, these are supposed to be hot. I have it on high, it shouldn't take too long. So what I started doing is making my, I have one cup milk. And I want two-thirds cup. I have one tablespoon. Uh, one tablespoon margarine. And I'll just put two-third. That's a one-third cup. So this this will be ready in minutes. And uh, back here is my bread, just to show you how dirt cheap this meal is going to be. I make a special point to get the bread marked down, so the bread's about two and a half cents each. Okay, the, the potatoes are hot now. So what I want to do is just pour my milk in until I get them nice and creamy. So this will be this will be ready within minutes. And I managed to make three three pie crust cookies out of my leftover dough. So what I'll do is I'll just uh, stir these these potatoes until they're nice and creamy. There's still I'll use a little water. I think I used all my the the recipe calls for water and milk, but I started using all milk. And I find my potatoes are much tastier. So this is really enough potatoes for two people. Uh-oh, my gravy is off. So this is the whole trick to instant mashed potatoes. See how they're looking good? So I'll just keep that up. Now back over here. Okay, so my... I turn my gravy off, otherwise it would have been practically ready. So I'll just stir it around until my lunch meat is is uh, ready. And if you keep stirring your potatoes, see how this is going to be a good roast beef sandwich? That's about 25, per 25 cents worth of... Of lunch meat. Okay, you guys, I'll be back.